Hi everyone, welcome to the Vaishi Makeup YouTube channel and today I'm going to show you this easy party makeup look which I did when I had to attend my friend's Sangeet ceremony and uh, it's an easy look so I would like to show you guys so shall we begin? To begin with I have applied eye primer on my eyes I used the UD eye primer and Frankly speaking, I'm quite bored of it, so I would like to try something else. If you have any recommendation for eye primer, then do let me know. I would love to try that. And uh, after applying the eye primer, I use this Coastal Scents eyeshadow, which is Oatmeal Tan. This is the shade which I reach out to quite often for blending. It is a dupe of MAC eyeshadow Soft Brown. So basically, I'm going to apply this shade in my crease and I'm going to blend it till I don't see the harsh line I'm going to apply this shade in the outer corner as well and then I'm going to take the next shade which is from coastal scents again it's called as light taupe and light taupe is a matte brown which flatters all skin tone it's a dupe of MAC charcoal, charcoal brown eyeshadow and it works beautifully on uh, as a crease shade as well I use my eco tool eye enhancing duo set brushes for it they are just six dollar brushes and they are basically four brushes into these come very handy to me when I do my eye makeup so with this uh, with this light taupe eyeshadow shade I'm going to just deepen up my crease area this way it will look like as if my eyes have more depth to it and then the next shade is burnt umber which is basically a matte finish shade which is a deep berry color and gives a matte finish and this is a beautiful shade which goes really well when you use it in the outer corner and uh, when you are doing a coal or an orange eye makeup even with gold it looks beautiful and I'm going to just blend this over the taupe shade and uh, that is again going to give a nice look without uh, without making it look very dark when we use a black eyeshadow the next shade from coastal scents is a hot pot s36 it's a golden brown with shimmer in it with yellow undertone and has a satin finish it's a shade which brighten up the eye and it's a perfect shade for tan or a brown skin like mine so i am use, going to be using this shade all over my eyelid and uh, I'm going to just leave the little shade of the outer corner and going to apply it all over my eyelid and make sure that it's blended out well when I'm applying it. Next comes the WhatsApp highlighter, one of my favorite highlighter which you will see me using it often and it's a perfect toned down shade which is just perfect to give a decent sheen on Indian or a brown skin tone like mine. I'm going to use this highlighter on my brow bone area and I'm going to because it's a cream highlighter so I'm going to use my finger to blend it up. On my lower lash line I'm going to use the Maybelline eyeliner and uh, on my waterline as well i'm going to apply the maybelline eyeliner and uh, and i'm going to uh, tight line my eyes with the maybelline eyeliner again and uh, i'm going to blend this eyeliner with a thin flat brush which is from real technique brush set only i'm going to link it in the description box the detail of this brush set and on top of this eyeliner i'm going to apply the very famous l'oreal infallible endless chocolate shade and this is going to basically just enhance the lower lash line and i'm going to apply the eyeliner which is the lotus eyeliner the link will be given in the description box and i'm going to leave the one third uh, one third of the eyeliner and give it the winged look and for the brows i'm going to fill the brows with the body shop brow kit and I'm going to make them look very natural and I'm not going to give them a, a artificial look and uh, again uh, I'm going to put my false eyelashes and then then I'm going to complete the look with the Revlon eyelash mascara which is one of my favorite so now I'm almost done with my eye makeup and let's move towards the 
face makeup and I've already applied the MAC NC42 Pro Long Wear Foundation and now I'm going to apply the L'Oreal Magic Lumi Highlighter which comes in a twist pan pack. I like how this highlighter just hides away all the imperfection from my face and uh, gives a natural glow with a hint of little, uh, little shine to it and uh, it's easy to blend and you can use it as a brow bone highlighter all in the inner corner of your eyes it's a perfect uh, highlighter to have and uh, it uh, it blends out beautifully although it's not available in India I use my detailer brush from the real technique brush set to blend this highlighter and it hardly takes me any time to blend this up and I do recommend this uh, highlighter the L'Oreal magic Lumi highlighter but uh, only problem is that uh, it finishes up really fast and compared to the price it's little expensive so now uh, I'm going to apply the blush I'm using the Milani baked blush Coralina which is a beautiful orange coral I missed uh, applying the compact on my face therefore I'm going to apply it now and then again reapply the blush the compact which I am using is is a shade lighter than my skin tone so basically it uh, uh, highlights the area which I have applied the uh, L'Oreal L'Oreal Lumi highlighter so let's just blend the compact and then reapply the blush the beautiful Milani baked blush Coralina. I'm going to apply the bronzer on the side of my nose and I'm not going to use it anywhere else and let's come to the highlighter again I'm going to apply the WhatsApp highlighter from Benefit on the area which I would like to highlight for example the uh, the cheekbones and uh, the the tip of my nose and the cupid bow so I'm going to just blend that with my fingers for the lipstick I'm using the MAC shade chili which is basically a red shade with orange tone to it and it's a perfect shade for a uh, party I really like it and it's kind of suit almost all skin tone and it's a perfect shade for tanned or brown skin tone and let's just blend again the key to makeup the a beautiful makeup is blending and let's come to the accessories which I really adore wearing them and uh, for a party or a bridal makeup look these are perfect I like big chunky accessories I hope you like the video guys and if you have any requests then do let me know in the comment section don't forget to like the video and uh, don't forget to share it i will see you again till then bye bye